New school year is almost here, and before long, you'll be making the kids' lunches again, right? Yes, indeed. But now doctors are alerting parents about a popular snack that could land your child in the ER. You see it right there, flaming hot. Now, 7 Action News reporter Jennifer Ann Wilson is here with the snack you may want to consider skipping. Spicy snacks like flaming hot Cheetos and Takis have become so popular that now you're seeing this fiery red powder on just about everything from popcorn to pork rinds to potato chips. And ask any kid, they'll tell you you can't stop at just one. And doctors say it could be doing damage to your kid's digestive system. Okay, hot Cheetos and Takis, hot Cheetos and Takis. From rap videos to local playgrounds, the consensus is in. I like them because I like spicy stuff and hot Cheetos are like spicy. That's nine-year-old Kayla. Her mom, Jeanette Tyser, owns every girl's dream summer camp for girls five through 12, and she's very familiar with the flaming hot craze. The kids, I offer them a snack in the morning and afternoon. In the morning, it's more of a healthy snack, fresh fruit. In the afternoon, I let them have more of a junk food type of snack. Um, one of their major requests would be uh, hot Cheetos. But could all this heat actually be dangerous? There's a lot of things that go around um, on the internet as far as kids being rushed to emergency for stomach pain or vomiting. So these hot Cheetos, and these hot snacks actually can damage your stomach because of the increased acidity that it can produce. WXYZ's Dr. Partha Nandy is a gastroenterologist and he's seen what these sizzling snacks can do. So these kids are eating them and, and they're having a lot of pain. It's because the amount of acid is more than the stomach and also the esophagus can handle. So bad that they end up in the emergency room. On top of that, just a small bag of these has 24 grams of fat and over 1,200 milligrams of sodium. This is a high fat processed, full of spice that it, it's to such a level that it actually increases the acid level in your stomach and can damage it. Dr. Nandy says it's important for parents to keep an eye out for signs of stomach pain in their kids. As for Kayla, well, she's got a pretty good grasp on her diet for a nine-year-old telling us what her favorite foods are. Grapes, strawberries, and pineapples. First, I try to eat healthy foods, then go to snacks. Frito-Lay has said previously that their snacks meet food safety regulations and that some consumers may be more sensitive to spicy foods than others. And in a statement, Taki said their snacks are safe to eat in moderation. Doctors say moderation is the key. Jennifer Ann Wilson, 7 Action News. Moderate.